Hey everyone, Jengo here. So I've discovered a little bug here. We've got the Austrian troops, um, well, looking a little bit strange. Well, the, and the, the obvious bug is the missing guns from my German troops. I may start to use counters uh, if I start to get more uh, irritated by that, but... Oh well, we will take the Austrians in a little bit anyway, so that's no problem. Okay, let's start continuing here. We were building our armies up. This uh, first army here was going all right. We were going to build a second army here, the third army. And uh, we have an army here and we will build an army here. And there will come an army here as well. <coughs> Electronical engineering, that's nice. We're going to put that and we're going to put it on chemical. Right, thank you. We've also built something. We build an infantry division and we are <coughs> prioritizing the Polish border. But of course we will uh, get to everything, but hopefully we'll run through this as quickly as possible. Here we have tanks, so that's no problem. This one is full, it's got five infantry divisions. So the next one is gonna come here. And it has a nice new uniform. That's good. And he does have a gun. Yay! First unit with a gun. <laughs> Fantastic. Okay, let's see. We don't want old guards in charge. I'm sorry. We don't need fortress uh, busters either. Do we have something? Yeah, trickster. That's nice. Surprise chances. Alright. Defensive. No, we don't want defensive here. So we're going to take the trickster. And we're going to connect it to... Uh, what is this? The 8th Ar uh, Armee Group core. Alright. Ah, uh, this one, yeah, in Suligao. Peru wants to have some energy from me. I, I think that's fine. Militia. Aeronautical engineering, that's good too. Very nice. We, it's almost, almost 37, so we're going to start with this, I think. Yes, we are going to start with this. Put, put them up. And, um, let's leave it at that. That's fine. And what else did we have? Oh yeah, militia, I almost forgot that. Militia, let's see, uh, this one. And we are going to first do that one. And when this is done, we're going to go back to the infantry. Okay, what do you want? Portugal wants some energy from me. How much energy do we have left? 14. Uh, no, no, thank you. We are done with energy. We want to keep it like this. Yeah. But it's good. Um, maybe we'll take some more of these, but we'll leave it like this for a while. That's fine. And you see, and that's the micromanagement with the trade. We have micromanaged it in the beginning. It was a little bit of work, but now that you have everything running and you have your deals running and everything is in the green and we're making money and we're building up stockpiles, we are happy, right? You're definitely happy. Light cruiser tech. Light cruiser tech. Yeah, okay, that's fine. We want some armor on those light cruises as well go artillery research that's infantry right yes there you go what was that ah ah that's uh, that's more of the uh, Okay, that's more of the, the theory. And that, that is fine. Militia going into mobile warfare a little bit as well and take the artillery away and get some nuclear fission going. Uh, okay. Militia anti-tank weapons, that was done as well. And we took tick, take this away and we're going for the small arms infantry advance okay militia support weapons 
also came up. We're going back to the infantry. We're very close to 37, so we will take that. We'll no longer receive rare materials. Okay, then we're going for another deal somewhere. Um, rare materials, maybe we'll take 10. Yes, the Axis, they are definitely drifting towards the Axis, the USA, that's good. Okay, so we will take a deal for hopefully 10. Like this, yes. Okay, go. And they accept it. That's nice. Yeah, a little bit more energy is alright. We've got 6 plus, so we should stop. definitely stop now with that. We've got armored gun. That's good. And do we have some more 1936 technology? Yes, yeah, so the, the anti-aircraft. That's fine. Queue that up. And we have an infantry division available. That's nice. Last one for this army here. And we definitely don't want that old guard guy again. So we're gonna go for uh, maybe one of those battle masters. Combined arms is good for infantry as well, but I prefer it on tanks. Yeah, we don't have much fortress busters. Well, Let's have a Fortress Buster in there, that's fine. So this core is now full as well, and this core is full. We want two medium tanks here, and this is full as well. We could build one more infantry division for this, and ferry it over with some uh, transports, but for that we need to build transports, so we're gonna queue that up. Some transports, please. Let's make two. Yes, thank you. We will also queue up a one convoy. Uh, sorry, one um, co yeah convoy and one escort, which gives plus ten, and we want to have that up a little bit. So these factories, I think we will put another ten factories up. We want to increase our uh, production if we can. So we've got that good going. I also want more two more infantry divisions queue up, queued up. Or maybe maybe we'll do one more light armor. Or two more. Yes. Okay, let's do that. Because we have more guys queued up anyway. Let's do this up this a little bit to 28. Reinforcements is fine, and this is fine as well. The upgrades will, will slowly come in, no problem. Okay, so here we go. Destroyer. Destroyer tech. Yeah, okay, that's fine. That is very good, very good. Alright, continue. What do you want? Energy? We just got some energy back, yeah, so that's fine. Anti-tank. Anti-tank. Yeah, you take that away and go there. We're working on the medium tank brigades and we're definitely gonna improve our light tanks. Light tanks have their uses, especially if your tech is good. They are very fast and you can do very nice pincer maneuvers with them. If supported by medium tanks. Yeah, we got something here again. Another infantry division. That's very nice. This one is full, so that uh, that is full. We don't have our transports yet, so we're gonna make uh, for this army. We're gonna make a very nice uh, core here, infantry core. Let's see. Put this one. In charge, make a core. Um, right, we need to check which is the last, which is the highest army core. 
Um, seems like the 12th army core is the highest core, yeah. So we need an X and 3, 13. We're gonna do that X, 1, 2, 3, point Arme Corps. Okay. Put a leader in. Um, yes, well, there's there's nothing here at the moment, so we're just gonna give this guy the lead there. He doesn't have any trade, but oh well. I'm gonna put that core here. As you see, I'm kind of I want <laughs> I want these guys to be separated so I can easily identify the headquarters once the war starts. So we're gonna continue. Let's go. Ah, the industrial capacity came in. That's very nice. So we're gonna queue up some more. Did all of them queue in? Yeah. Okay. That is very nice. Um, so yeah, so we're gonna look at where we made the first ones. And we're gonna continue making them here because it's a little bit further away from two three four five six seven eight nine and ten that's fine the scent is up we don't want the scent. We don't like the scent. Okay. Yes. Go. So this is your research screen. You, you can see which uh, provinces have what. Here Dresden has. You see a little pop up here. Dresden has 5 metal and 10 energy. And if, if you want to see which provinces have nice resources. You can check that over there. And we're going back to the political map mode. As we don't need that right now. Um, yes, so here we have the second light armor brigade and we want to start putting them into corpses so that the corps have uh, punching power so that they can fight for the traits of the generals uh, appointed to headquarters that they also improve. This is the second army corps so I want to link this to the second army corps. Uh, let's see if we can find it. Yeah, the, here it is in Butlo. Yeah, Butlo, Buto, or whatever the name is of that province. We're gonna link it there. And now our um, Army Corps, our headquarter queue, has a light armored brigade attached to it, which gives it combat power. So that is nice. This headquarter now has 1 1 instead of 0 1. So it can now fight, it can help fight, and that is good. We are first going to give all the cores one, one, one brigade, one tank brigade, and after that we may look at some infantry for them and stuff like that. But uh, we are, we are going to do it step by step, and we're not going to let our, um, let our other production of our main infantry division suffer too much from it. So let's look at the production. We still have roads are coming in. That's good too. Let's get our practical construction up as well. We still have a brigade coming here and we have a panzer division coming in with two artillery. We have three infantry divisions coming in and here two more army brigades. So we don't need another one. What we do need is another two infantry brigades as reserves and go. After that, let's go. Infrastructure came in here. Artillery bar barrels. Yeah, where are you? Yes, very nice. So we are moving very close to 47. And we have no more 36 Qs here. So we're going to put this on a light tank gun. And when it pops over to 37, we will lose the penalty. Artillery brigades, we're gonna put them 
on yeah there that's nice and on an army on a on an uh, infantry division maybe this one yeah that doesn't really matter where you put those but we gotta keep building those because we want to fill up all our divisions battleship engine uh, yes that's nice it's all 38 this is all 38 this is 38 38 38 okay so let's make the easiest let's put up the easiest heavy cruiser main armament there and we have some stuff that is over time but like I said we are gonna go into 37 pretty soon get this a little lower like this yeah so nice everything in the green we're losing power really well some of those deals will will crash soon enough anyway that will not be a problem oh yeah let's check our um, party organization for a sec here it's gone over 40 it's nice well this fluctuates so much it's insane but we don't live in a democracy so it doesn't really matter does it Italy doesn't want our energy anymore. Yeah, you see, th those deals uh, regularly fall into the, you know, they don't want it anymore. So we're going to get some energy back sooner or later. I'm not too worried about that. There's a second light army brigade. We want to put it in uh, this one, in the first Panzer Corps. So let's do that. First Panzer Corps, where are you? There you are. And go. Done. A little bit change to the sliders here. We want to keep an eye on that as always. This one can be a little closer to what it is right now. So gives you another 0.40 production, which is always nice. Trap pumped. Uh, Oh, that's nice. Uh, doctrine. Morale. For our... Armor. Um, yeah, let's keep it at that and then go for operational command structure. That's fine. Yeah. It's a difficult one. It's a, a heaviness of 10 it has. So that's... That's quite heavy and difficult to research. We've put that one in Kessel. Okay, we've got room. Let's build a, a rocket site somewhere. Maybe somewhere here. Maybe in Breslau. Maybe Breslau is a nice place for that. It's quite expensive, 28, but we need to build at least one rocket site somewhere. So that we can start researching that when the time comes. Yeah, well, we have enough fuel, guys. Thank you. What do you want? USA. Crude oil? No, thank you. We've got enough crude oil. Uh, 37, yes, that's fine. Okay, light armor. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, everything's queued up nicely. Let's go. Delay doctrine advance. So our doctrines are coming in very nicely here. We're gonna stay on this one, it's still on 36. We're gonna push that up. And then we can go here and once this one turns in, we're gonna go here and here. Maybe switch this around as well. Uh, we have some more sliders changed again. The upgrades don't need as much anymore. Maybe we push this back too. Seven or something, it should be fine. Agriculture, nice. So we have moved into 37 here, which is great because now we can queue up some of the industry advances, which we're gonna put on education. We're gonna click on industrial, both of those and supplies. 
We want all of that running. And maybe, maybe, just maybe, we will prioritize this and this and education. That should be a good choice. Okay, let's go. Lead Auxiliary Carrier Doctrine. So that's a naval doctrine. This one. I mean, we can now research a little bit more of the crew technologies as well. That's very important. We're going to put a little bit more here. Battleship. Up, okay. That's nice. Infantry division. We will put that here. We have new leaders as well. Let's check them out. Every year you get new leaders. So we have a little bit more here. Um, let's see, do we have offensive doctrine or traits? Any? Yeah, here. Nice. Okay. And we put it connected to this guy, which is fine. At the ground control. That's nice, we can stay, we can keep it on that. We're gonna start doing some stuff here as well. Fighters and this tactical uh, medium bombers. And we're gonna start here as well. And we, uh, no, no, this can only be done in 38, that's fine. This one was already on. Yeah, looks good. There's nothing there yet. Okay, everything is good. Artillery. Yes. Cancel that. Go for the light tank advances. And that is just fine. Nationalist Spain won! Ooh. All right. Uh, Panzer Division, that's nice. That's gonna go there. Light Panzer Division. Do we have a Battle Master? Yeah, that's fine. That's a good guy to have in charge there. Connected to the Panzer Corps and to the hierarchy. And that is fine. So we're going to put in another Panzer Division. One is enough. Now let's see, what else do we need? The more infantry maybe? Oh, we already have two here. Yeah. So we have four infantry divisions coming up. We have no Air Force coming in right now, so we definitely want another fighter and another stuka maybe we should start with these tactical bombers as well yeah because we want to flesh out our air force logistical strike tactical advance okay where was that again I think it is an air doctrine. Yeah, there it is. And we're gonna put this up to 36 as well. That is fine. What does Hungary want? It wants fuel. Maybe we should drop one of our electricity deals because that's been going on pretty long now. Uh, let's see, we're selling energy eight energy that's not enough energy 15 Sweden 
23 energy to Netherlands, 32 energy to Hungary. We're gonna conquer Hungary, so I don't care about influencing them anymore. So we're gonna take that back and we should be positive. Yeah, we're positive again. No, no, we don't wanna sell any energy right now. Infantry division came up, that's good. We're gonna put it here. All right. And who we will put in charge? Somebody with offensive and defensive. Yeah, why not? That's nice. Connect it to the hierarchy. This guy now has three, two more, and we can start building another infantry core here. And flesh out this army. Ah, Marines. Fantastic. Awesome. We're gonna go for uh, Arctic. Or are we? We are going to go for light infantry. That sounds like a better idea. And once this pops, we're gonna put it here. And once this one da is done, we're gonna put it on Arctic equipment. That sounds like a plan. That's a good plan. Another infantry division. Yes, thank you. Put that one here. Who are you? Battlemaster, no, we want you on a tank. That should be alright. Do we have some attackers? I want offensive. Without... Offensive, yes. On both. Alright. That means we lost two infantry corps in the queue. And we're gonna queue up two more. Two of you, yes thank you, and we're gonna put some anti-tanks in the queue again, yeah, and some uh, artillery, yes, okay that's all nice and good, we've got two light army brigades coming in for the headquarters again, and maybe we want to put one up for that as well, there we go. What does the Soviet Union want from us? Rare materials. How much money do we have? Yeah. And we have negative, so that sounds like a good plan. Uh, Stuka, Stuka, Stuka. Go to the Stuka fleet. Thank you. No, we don't want to buy fuel, guys. No, thank you. We lost a little bit of metal, but we want some more of that. Of uh, rare materials. Chemical engineering research advance. Okay. It's in theory. That's great. We're gonna go back to mechanical and up that. And we're gonna go and see who wants to sell us some rare materials. USA maybe? How's USA going? It's drifting towards us still. Very slowly. Yeah, okay. Um, Let's make that 10. Well, maybe 20. Yep, they accepted light. Medium tank brigade, yes, that's nice. And light cruiser armor. Let's do the cruiser first. That's good. Let's get that um, submarine stuff on the way. And armor. We've got the medium tanks unlocked, that's great. So we're gonna put research into the gun immediately and when this pops we're gonna throw them over here. And we're gonna go research that. Queue that up. We lost a little bit of trade there. Energy. And what do you want? Energy as well. We don't want to sell that much, but maybe that's alright. 
Sweden. A deal with Sweden came through. Mobile Warfare Research Advance. Militia, okay. That's in theory. That's great. So we're gonna go with infantry first here now. And. Mobile warfare, it's a land doctrine. Or maybe not. <laughs> Sometimes you just forget where things are supposed to be. Mobile, unitary, yes we did that. Militia small arms. Ah, that's militia small arms, okay. Misread that. Click that away here, put it there. And that's great, that's fine. Gonna go for the 38 level of infantry. Technology. You want your infantry very strong, and you need to research the uh, the right tech for that. Okay, and a battle cruiser. Okay, that's also 38 now. That's great. Gonna go for the. Well, do we want that already now? Not yet. So we're gonna continue here with the battleship technology now once we build them for our campaign against Britain we will need good technology because the British definitely have good technology there what did ah our transports that's great okay so we've got transports the next infantry can go here and fill up uh, this uh, core and then we should have, we should be ready with this first uh, army here, except for two medium tanks. That's fine. I think that's gonna be an episode here, guys. I want to thank you all for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Hey, so I hope you enjoyed the video, that you learned something there. If you are already a subscriber, don't forget to like the video. You know, those likes really make a difference. Do leave me a comment. You know, I always look forward to the comments every day. And if you really feel like helping out today, make sure to share the video with your friends and let them know about the channel. If you're new here, make sure to hit the subscribe button, become part of this community. I really love to have you aboard. And uh, don't feel shy to leave me some comments. I always try to respond to them. So again, I wanna thank you all for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.